very brief break in the rain. I cannot believe how much it's been raining. We have every day, every day, every day, every day, it's raining, raining, raining all the time. It was already raining today, and now the sun is out, briefly. It's gonna rain again. So I figured I'd come out and check real quick what's going on with the garden. So, um, we are getting sunflowers. Look, look. See it? It's starting. They all are having their little chip flow ready. That's exciting. Amy's pretty happy about that. I do have work I need to do out here that I can't get done with all of this rain. I want to plant my fall garden. I'm going to get that started. And I keep waiting for a break in this rain, and it's just not happening. So, I don't know what I do, work in the rain, maybe? <laughs> I need to clear all this out. We're going to clear this out and make this a whole fall garden. Um, we start getting things planted in the ground now. We're, we're what, mid-August here in uh, Western Mass. So, we have to get some stuff planted. We already have some lettuce over here. As you can see, right there, a little bit. It's right there. Um, this whole thing was planted with lettuce, and then they came in and they ground this stump. This used to be a big tree. And trampled it all. Just, yeah. So, we want to replant that. We want to get garlic. Um, it's a few things I'd like to plant. Like that. It's coming in. Not all of them. So out of the six plants that I planted for broccoli, the little guys, we have five of them that survived. That's a success, I'd say. We have the squash plant that for some reason did not make it. Not sure what happened still, but there it is. Um, so what I'm going to do is take that out and I'm going to use that space for more fall planting. But we can see that we have some stuff we can pick over here. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. work better inside planter beds than, than uh, others. So I think like next year I would not be planting in a planter bed for pumpkins. I would not plant watermelon or cantaloupe. Anything that's got vines that kind of crawl out, I wouldn't plant in a planter bed. Everything else though, like broccoli, tomatoes, all that's doing well. The squash, that's all fine. Done. Well, they're still probably growing. Yeah, pick. 
I'm gonna get that away. All of it. My onions are going. Parsley is good. All of this. Uh, my oregano is growing. My sweet mint. My orange flowers. A lot of them. I only have like three when I got them. Or maybe four. I don't know. Emily's sunflowers. Look at you can see a little sunflower up there. But you can't see that it's yellow. It's a little yellow. That's good. I'll show you the pumpkins and show you the rest of them over there. We found some purple flowers. And that's part of the plant. All of it. And see. You guys can see it. Let me get a little better view of it. Show you the other one. That one. That one's doing good. Our tomatoes. Tomatoes. Are going. Bunch here, bunch up top. It's fantastic. And then you can see over here, there's some growing. There's stuff growing here. All of this is growing except for this one. Pull that out for our fall garden. Our broccoli is growing. Our broccoli there. There, humongous. See a little one in there? Uh, a little tiny one. And I don't know about the one over there, but I can't get to it. Let's look at all this video tea. Mom, I put the I put the ones in here. Okay. Well, I'm gonna make. So I'm making dinner, and I'm realizing we make a medley out of the vegetables, and I'm realizing that everything in this medley, except for the onions, is from our garden, and that is an amazing feeling. I love it. Look at this. Everything except for the onions. There's tomatoes, zucchini, um, squash green pepper. It's all from our garden. That's awesome. Oh, subscribe down below, turn locations, and give us a huge thumbs up. Bye! Bye! Say bye, Mom.